Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's shall be oh why between the game sports back give you another great video and topic but y'all know the drill man please hit that thumbs up button for me subscribe and then hit that bell button to get those notifications man but look check this out about this young man named abdul malik mclean i believe here's a young man that's at jackson state uh, was at Jackson State, but he was apparently just arrested. But it's not about him, really. This is about ESPN and the nonsense that they're doing right now. And he, as you can see right there, he was arrested on some COVID scheme and stuff like that. But this is what I'm saying. Look at this bottom ticker right here. This bottom ticker. There was a time when Coach Prime at the beginning of the season when he was saying that he wanted to see Jackson State and more HBCUs on the bottom ticker. And then now all of a sudden, after Jackson State signs the number one guy, they lose in the Celebration Bowl. And now all of a sudden, now ESPN can report on the bad things that are happening <laughs> at Jackson State. And it's very, very comical to me because this is what I say uh, all the time about the game within the game. And of course, people are going to say, well, Jackson State wanted that attention. Now they're getting it. Okay, that's fine. But let's report. Let's do a better job of reporting on what the good things that are going on with Jackson State, ESPN, and other outlets. <clears throat> like I said, there was a time when Coach Palmer at the beginning of this season was asking for Jackson State and other HBCUs to get more exposure on ESPN's bottom ticker. And now all of a sudden, this kid, Abdul Malik McLean, he gets in trouble. They're on, <laughs> they're on the ESPN ticker. That's just funny to me. Anybody else thinks that's funny, man, please let me know because I think that's very, very funny. And, and it's crazy because if this would have happened uh, anywhere else, anywhere else, and the HBCU, this will be no news. But because Jackson State has become very famous right now in the talk of the town, now ESPN wants to talk about it. I just don't understand. I do understand, and I know why they're doing it. But come on, let's be real. Let's get better ESPN uh, and other outlets. Man, they're not the only ones that's doing this kind of stuff. But let's do better at promoting better news good news not always the bad stuff and it's unfortunate for this young man that he got caught up in this and he decided to do that well he got to live with that and he's been taken off the roster at jackson state and um you know he's got to deal with that situation but i just find it funny now all of a sudden that espn wants to report on jackson state in their ventures and what's going on down there <laughs> it's just funny to me anybody else thinking the way I'm thinking, please let me know down in the comments. Am I right or wrong in this situation, man? I love y'all for always tuning in to me and listening to me about these things, man. But I just have to get this off my chest. But if y'all with me, please let me know down in the comments. As always, on your best day, be better. For 20 Game Sports, I'm out. Peace.